Alright, so we have a quest for Rogue. Um, the only Rogue deck I have is Mill Rogue, so I guess we're going to be playing Mill Rogue. I am versus Uther. Alright, let's see. Watch your um, I don't really need this Vanish. I, I kind of want the Agent, but I don't really need him. I need something lower. Well, Death Lord's good. He's three mana, and he gives me a little, a little bit of woo for him. Alright. So, we have nothing to play. We, luckily, Rogue does have her hero ability. Then I don't usually waste a round two. I mean, I guess you don't really need to waste a round two on any of them, but I don't have anything to play. So it always feels like a waste. Coin to, oh, coin to a grizzly. It's not too bad. I, I'm just gonna death lord. I'm not gonna sap it or anything. I'll need my sap later. Like I said, we're playing mill rogue, so we're in this for the long haul. Hopefully, this video doesn't actually end up to be a long haul. Hopefully, it's moderately fun and not 30 minutes long. My me think. opponent didn't take so much time, we would be a little bit quicker through this video. Alright, so it looks like he's going to try to buff up and take out my Death Lord, which is fine. Now that he's got a 6-1 and a 1-1, I'm probably going to Phantom Knight. Yeah. I'll just fan, and then attack Here we go. So we're off to a decent start. We still got our death lord out. We got 30 health. Our opponent's got 26 health and we're on mana 4 now. We're not into the big the big guys yet, so ooh. I don't know if I can really I may need to sap that. I really don't want to. But I'm not in a position where I can really start my fatigue. So, I can attack him and then hope that I get some kind of shiv or something. Or I can, let's just see what I get. Um, I can eviscerate him and then death lord him. Thank you. And then that'll pull out his minion. Okay, he's got a taunt. Um, I can live with that. That's a lot less damage. Alright. It's not ideal, but it's still a lot less damage than what he had. Although, no, I can't attack his face. Give him a minion divine shield. That's alright, because he's probably going to attack. Alright. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. I'm gonna try to see if I can burn him out a little bit. Thank you. I don't have a gang up. Shit. I need to uh, probably prep him back to my hand. I mean, uh, shadow step him back to my hand. Let's see. I'll play him again. Screw it. Oh, I got another shadow step. That's good. All right, I managed to burn out one of his cards. I can shadow step. I can actually play him again. Let's go ahead and do it. Screw it. Thank you. All right, so we burned out a couple of his cards, especially ones that seem like they're probably going to be useful. 
The only downside is now my oracle's out and I don't have a gang up, so the way that I play this deck is going to change once he kills that oracle. I was hoping he wouldn't kill it and I could shot, uh, I could vanish it. If I could vanish it, then I could have waited till I got my gang up. It's okay. I, I'll still be able to play. I might just go ahead and vanish anyway. I don't have any minions out and I can give him two minions back into his hand. He's got nine. So that'll be 10 and 11. He'll burn two. So yeah, let me do that. I'll preparation to reduce the cost. And then I'll vanish. That'll burn. I don't know which minion, but it'll burn his minion. And then I'll go ahead and attack. I need to get his health down in case we start fatiguing. And I can make sure that he takes enough damage to go uh, to die off fatigue. I don't know what he's got in his hand. I still have... I still have enough... Okay, so luckily I got uh, BGH. I can take him out. I'm not too concerned with him. I don't know what he's going to have after that. I still have Vanish to take care of that, so... We'll see. We're still at 30. He's at 20. But now that we don't have enough to burn his cards out, we use all of our oracles. I'm going to have to be a lot more careful with how I play. Interesting. I wonder if he'll get face or if he'll take out my BGH. It's a decent trade, I guess. Needs to get my minion off the board. <coughs> Let's see, actually, I think. I'm trying to think. There's a couple combos I can do, but none of them are really that good with the stupid uh, so many options. Silver Hand Recruit out. It doesn't really get me anything, so I'm just going to play this. And go face. Here we go. I could have played a couple other combos, but there's no reason. I could have kept my agent, but I need something out on the board. I gotta keep constant pressure on him. Plus, I can just vanish if, depending on what he plays this turn. Another Death Lord. I still haven't seen my gang up. Hmm. I might need to go ahead and combo over here. Try to get him down. Oh, thanks for showing up now, gang. Yeah, I'll go ahead and sacrifice this guy. Toss out my Death Lord. And, oh shit, I forgot to attack. Oh well. I should have attacked and then re-upped my weapon, but I forgot. Got too big of a hurry and was thinking too much about my, uh, what I needed to play that hand. So I don't know what he's going to have left in his hand. Hopefully he doesn't have anything too big. Although I could gang up one for many and he puts out if it's something nice. Let me think. I still have my brand and anti-kill bot, so I have a decent oh shit. I have a decent combo to get a lot of my health back. Got another gang up finally. I think. I 
based on the cards I have in hand. Uh, Vanish is probably my best choice. I can try to take these minions out, but I should I should probably vanish, but I'm gonna try to just go ahead and take them out. I have gang up and anti kill bot, so I can take his min his his minion out. I can't make him burn a card. Well, I could have vanished, I suppose. But uh, I think I'm gonna try to take this minion out. Once I get low enough in health, I can brawn and anti kill bot, and then I don't have to worry about these minions getting played again. Reporting for duty. Especially that ogre. All right, well, I gotta vanish this time. I'll burn his, his, uh, his buff. I can't have that buff on the board. Here we go. It's not going to be a long-term solution, and now it comes back full health, but I just can't have that. Oh, that's good. Uh, burned his weapon, but I can't have him having that big of a minion on the board. So now we're getting down into it. We have two gang ups, an anti kill bot, a brand. So we don't. I mean, we really only have two. Two minions. Now we're getting into the sticky, uh, sticky situation. All right, I got another hill bot. So it's probably gonna be best to play. Play Hillbot. Backstab him. Get him off the board. Start whittling this guy down. Still have my brand. Still have my anti killbot. So I'm hoping he goes face and doesn't kill my killbot with his ogre. He's almost out of cards, so I'll have him in fatigue soon. This would have been faster if I would have ganged up, but uh, ganged up my oracles. But Let me I think. played him too soon, I think. I mean, I was able to. Oh, that's a good card. That's a little bit scary. He's got a lot of damage on the board right now. I don't know what, I mean, I guess it depends on what card I draw, but he's got a pretty decent amount of damage on the board and I have nothing to do with it. Nothing to get rid of it with. Move quickly. Uh, I mean, I could always gang up his 6-6 six, six, and then Hillbot. Okay, I can Belcher. That buys me a little time. And then gang up. I'll do that and hopefully buff some of my minions. Alright, I'm gonna... He doesn't have lethal on board. So I'm gonna risk it. He's got dang close to lethal, but he doesn't have lethal on board. He's got to get through my Belcher, and then my secondary taunt, and then I can be concerned with what's after that. The victory is. What the hell? Why did he quit? Well, that works for me. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and share. Thanks for watching.